Hello, in this video, I'm going to go over how to set up a PayPal business account on your Streamlabs account so you're able to take donations for your Twitch. In this tutorial, if you learn a lot, I would appreciate if you hit that subscribe button. So the first step is you're going to want to go to your Streamlabs account. And I'm kind of just showing you full circle of how this works. So basically, to set up a PayPal Plus account and get this connected, you're going to need a PayPal business account. So before we can click connect and connect our PayPal business account, we need to actually go sign up for a PayPal business account. So just go to paypal.com. Awesome. And then once you get to paypal.com, uh, click sign up. On this step, it's gonna ask if you want a personal business account and you're gonna wanna click business account and click next. The reason why you want to click PayPal business instead of PayPal personal account is whoever donates to you on your PayPal business account, your first name and last name won't be visible. Only your business name and email address will be visible. Whereas a PayPal personal account, your first name and last name will be visible to whoever donates to you. For example, take a look at this comparison chart that I created. As you can see with a PayPal personal account, um, what is visible to people that donate to you on their bank statement. They'll be able to see your first name and last name as well as your email. And so for example, if your first and last name is John Doe, they'll be able to see John Doe and then your email that you have. Whereas uh, a PayPal business account, um, they just see the name of your business and your email address. With that said, whatever email you do use to register your PayPal business account, will still be visible to whoever does donate to you. That's why to guarantee even more privacy, I would recommend creating a streaming email solely used for your Twitch account. Um, it is free on Google and here's how you can do it. Um, just go to this link and I'll put it in the description box below and then enter your first name, last name. So I'm gonna just put Jack Anderson or something like that. Um, and then for your username, you're gonna wanna put your Twitch username. So in this case, it would be like Twitch Slayer tutorial 9999 at gmail.com and then just enter a password and then you press next and then you don't have to enter your phone number so I won't um, you can just put a recovery email address um, for what for another email address that you have I'll just put this right here and then put your birth date And then click next and then for the privacy and terms disagree and then it's as simple as that you uh, you set up your uh, streaming only uh, gmail account now we can go back to uh, setting up our paypal business account so on this step you're going to enter in your actual first name last name and email address and then create a password and click agree and create account and then click get verified so on this step, uh, it's going to ask you if you're a sole proprietorship or company. I think for 98% of, of you guys on this video, it's going to be a sole proprietorship. So click that. Um, then make sure here to actually put your actual first name and last name. And then PayPal is going to ask you what's your business called. This is going to just go on um, people that uh, give you donations, credit card statements. So you could you know keep your first name or um, just put it in like your your Twitch username, which in my case, I'll put like Twitch Slayer Tutorial 999 or something like that. Um, and then for your phone number, you wanna put your actual phone number. Um, this is just for uh, PayPal sake. And then what's your address? I was gonna ask you what your address is um, and make sure to actually put your actual address details. So after you're done with that, um, click uh, fill in everything, click save and continue. So once you get to this step, PayPal wants some more information about your business. So basically um, your business is not a no nonprofit, so don't click this. And then for product or service keywords, just put something like uh, internet or try finding like something like streaming. Yeah, put something like this, streaming, television, radio streaming, click that. And then what are your monthly sales? Um, I always, for majority, like 90, 99% of you is probably gonna be below 5,000 per month. So just click up to um, 5,000 per month. And then it's gonna ask if your business has a website, just click no, unless you do actually have a website. 
and then uh, I always just unchecked it because I don't want to, um, you know, PayPal business debit MasterCard. So then click save and continue. So now on this step, it's going to ask you for your, like your social security number and date of birth, home address. Again, put in your actual information. PayPal does a little bit of a ver verification check. So make sure you put in your actual details here or else you'll never be able to set up a valid PayPal business account. So once you're done with this step, click submit. So once you're done signing up for your PayPal business account, you may need to confirm your email. You can also you know, link your bank account. So any tuition donations that are sent to your PayPal account can automatically be deposited into your personal checking account. PayPal business might also ask you a few other verifications such as um, a copy of your driver's license um, or when your business was established. If they ask you for your driver's license, you'll also have to upload a front and back photo of your driver's license. And if they ask you for your business establishment date, I would just put today's date or the date that you registered your PayPal business account. So when you're done setting up your PayPal business account, you want to go back to your Streamlabs account and underneath uh, tip methods in PayPal Plus, once you click connect, it's going to ask you this and then just click connect. Um, and then it's going to, uh, PayPal is going to open up a screen and you're going to want to enter in the email that you use to set up your PayPal business account. And in this case, I think it would be like Twitch Slayer Stream 999 at gmail.com. And then click next and uh, you should be all set. That's all I have for you guys today. If you guys have any questions, make sure to put them in the comments below. And if you got value to this video, make sure you hit the subscribe button. Have a great day.